What's going on beautiful people? Welcome to Daily Tarot where we pull one tarot card per day to gauge the energy that we're working with today and to do a mini internal energy calibration check. Are you ready? Let's dive right in. And the tarot card for Sunday, January 24th is the Cernunos. So this card is correspondent with the Devil card in the traditional Rider Waite tarot deck and it is all about calling us to face our shadow. I don't know, should we face our shadow? I feel like it's a pretty good idea. Oh my god, no it's not. We shouldn't face our shadow, it's too scary. Ah! Maybe we are being confronted with our darker selves, right? The side that maybe doesn't feel too good to really fully look at in the mirror. And that's okay. So when we can see this shadow aspect of ourselves, we have a couple choices, right? We can choose to ignore it, we can choose to accept and integrate it, or we can choose to reject it entirely. What is it that we are going to choose to do? Are we going to choose to understand these aspects of ourselves and to accept them, to really hold them with love and gentle kindness and compassion? and know that these aspects of ourselves are adaptation mechanisms that we learned in order to survive? Or are we going to reject these parts of ourselves that we very much needed early on in childhood in order to make it to where we are now, to who we are now? Are we gonna tell that part of ourselves that no, you are unlovable, I don't want you? Does that feel good? Does that feel good for you guys to say? And if that does not feel good for us to even think about saying to a part of ourselves, why do we do it? The Nunos is calling us to deeper levels of liberation, surrender, and freedom. When we claim all of ourselves as our own, when we claim responsibility for our lives, this is when we can step in to true sovereignty, to true ownership and responsibility for the way that we are and for the lives that we are leading and creating. When we can do this, do you know how powerful you can be when you claim full responsibility for your own shit? That is some powerful magic, my friends. It is not a weakness to understand that we all have shortcomings, right? We all have stuff that we're working on, myself included. And when we are able to do this, this is actually a great strength because it allows us to hold these parts of ourselves with acceptance and to be able to really work on the parts of ourselves that we know need work. The parts of ourselves that are holding us back, that are keeping us small, that are keeping us stuck, stuck? that are keeping us stuck and trapped. And when we can do this, we will allow ourselves to be free because we are the ones that are putting the key into the lock that is keeping ourselves trapped. Thank you so much for joining me for Daily Tarot. I hope this served you well. If it resonated, don't hesitate to hit that like button, smash that subscribe, and I will see you guys all again tomorrow. Have a magical rest of your day.